video may contain content parents may find unsuitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey everybody, it's Hunger again, and welcome to Pokemon Clover How To. Uh, today, we're going to be doing a guide on Memes, Inc. Uh, before we get started, I just wanted to, to explain why I'm doing this guide and why now. Uh, so, my episode 37 of my original Pokemon Clover playthrough is the third part of Memes, Inc., and it is one of the most viewed videos on the channel. It's over 5,000 views. It's also one of the most disliked videos on the channel, uh, because it's not a how-to guide. And that's what people are coming there looking for. They're looking for uh, a guide that's going to take them through it. And when they get to, when, when they're watching along and I'm, and I'm making cuts and edits and things, they're, they, they get frustrated. And I actually put an unlisted video in, uh, a link to an unlisted video down in the comments that sort of explains how to get through the part that I cut out. Uh, but people still dislike the video anyway, uh, because I guess they don't notice it or so, I've been planning on doing this video for a while where I just do one video that's a step-by-step -step guide for Memes Inc., but I was planning on waiting until after the new version of Clover releases. Uh, but that's been taking forever, and since I just recorded the Master Cuts versions of those Memes Inc. episodes, I figured, well, while I still have the footage and everything, let me go ahead and edit everything together into one cohesive guide. So that is what this is. Uh, now this is a step-by-step -step guide, and step one is talking to the Team Karma Grunt about the card key. Uh, now the path to get to her is a little convoluted, so I'm going to show the whole thing here, uh, starting from the second floor. Mango City, go through the sewers, and come out the front entrance to get over here to the company housing next to Memes Inc. You're going to be looking for a specific NPC who will give you an item. If you try to find this NPC before talking to the Team Karma Grunt about the card key, they will not be there. Step three, you're going to head back to Animango City again. This time you're going to be looking for the building with Caps Lock Prime written on the front of it. This building is Team Karma's old hideout, and you can use the key that you just got to get in there. Uh, I'm going to show the way to the card key, which you need to find in this building, right now. <laughs> For step four. Now, before I go into this path, I do want to just remind everybody that I recommend doing Memes Inc. before 
facing Freddy at the Beehive City Gym. Uh, and the main reason for that is because the trainers inside of Memes, Inc. are one of the best sources of experience to train up your team to make sure you don't have a really bad time against Freddy. Now, that said, this path is going to take you straight to the end, and you're going to miss a lot of those trainers. So I do recommend kind of wandering around Memes, Inc. and facing off against as many trainers as you can before finishing. Uh, that way you have a better chance against Freddy when you finally go to face him. Uh, that said, when you're ready to finish Memes, Inc., head to the 7th floor via the stairs of the elevator and follow this path. After reaching the CEO of Memes, Inc. Uh, and meeting Team Karma's little bro, uh, little bro takes a powder. He runs off. So in order to find him, you're going to need the key to Team Karma's sewer hideout. And to find it, you're going to have to head back to Animango City again. Once in Animango City, you're going to go to the gym, and there's a small gap on the left side of the gym leading up. Uh, and there's a building behind the gym that has the key you need. Once you're inside, you're going to head up to the top floor and talk to the Team Karma grunt that you find there, and he will give you the key to the sewer hideout. Step 6. Now that you have the key to the sewer hideout, it's time to find Little Bro. Now, in addition to several trainers in the hideout, there is a floor that has a pretty annoying maze with some arrow tiles, and I'm going to show you a solution to that now. Uh, now keep in mind that you can still wander around and find some items uh, in this maze, and I do encourage that, uh, but uh, you can skip the master ball though. <laughs> Once you have the lift key, you could you could go back to the lift and take it to B4 and, f and go straight into Little Bro's office. Which brings me to the final and probably the most important step, step seven, like this video. Uh, if, you've, if you found this video useful in getting through Team Karma's Memes, Inc. and finding Little Bro afterwards, make sure you like the video so that other people who are having the same problem are having an easier time finding it. Thank you, and have a great day. Bye-bye!